See what I mean? Like they're way more like bitch. Like I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. it sounds like a like the way a happy bitch. You know what I mean? What's up, guys? It's my three month update. I have a few things I want to talk about. It'll be a short video. So here we go. So it's been three months since I had my denture uh, put in. It's been uh, almost five months since my extractions. My gums are healing well. Um, I do use the adhesive. If I don't use the adhesive, um, they're a little loose and they, they will move if I, if I don't have the adhesive. So I use adhesive all the time. Um, I use the, the fix it in ultra. So a few struggles that I had in the last, well, first of all, getting the dentures, the, the main two struggles are talking and eating. Uh, you might notice my S's are way more pronounced now than I think they've ever been in my life. But whatever, you know, it's better than having no teeth. So, so those are the first few struggles I noticed. Um, after, after I got over that, I, uh, you know, accepting the dentures was a big one too. You know, accepting the fact that, uh, mentally, um, a part of me is gone and a foreign piece is now a part of me. It's kind of a tough pill to swallow knowing that that part of you is gone. You know, it's your teeth, but it's still, it was still part of you and now it's gone completely forever. That's a big one. So, um, also the ups and downs, you know, you, get, you think about it too much and it's not going to, it's not going to be always positive. You gotta look at the positive side. You know, I, I look better, I look healthier, I am healthier. Um, so those are the kind of things that I focus on. Um, also, you know, you're, there's no more pain, no more toothaches, no more bad breath, you know, rotten teeth, decaying cavities, none of that, no more, none of that. So that's definitely, definitely helps when you think about it so on top of that um in the last few months the only thing i've done is uh trim the palette on my denture to make it more comfortable for me so when the when i first got it uh it hit my gag reflex when i first got it, it was straight across and so i trimmed out the palette to give more room for my uh, upper mouth and the back of my throat area so the only thing I did was trim my palate I made a video on that um, that's the only um, thing I've done as uh, like trimming wise um, I was uh, fortunate enough that my denture fit like out of, uh, I'd say like an 8 out of 10 is the fit like that's how good it is I just wanted to go over a few things. So, uh, at first, we had the, you know, getting used to the hockey puck in your mouth and talking with it. I still pronounce uh, a few words off and definitely pronounce the S's. 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 See what I mean? Like, they're way more, th like, bitch. Like, S's. Is, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. it sounds like a, like the way a preppy bitch talks. You know what I mean? Anyway, so I'm happy with my decision. E looks better. The only thing I don't like is like they don't match. The denture is like really pink. It's whatever, you know. I don't care. I don't care about that. I just don't have rotten ass teeth in my mouth anymore. That's what I care about. You know, my kids don't look at me like, ew, daddy's got yucky teeth. Or, you know, whatever. And they, you know, when I give my kids a kiss goodnight, they don't have to worry about that rotten breath or, you know, ugh. Anyways, that's all gone, pain gone. 
So yes, I'm happy with my decision. Uh, so those of you who struggle with getting dentures at a young age, think about the positives. Think about the positives. You know, I make these videos to also help myself focus on the positives because sometimes I, I get, you know, get caught up in the thoughts and you start thinking the negative side like I'm only 32 and I have dentures and whatever. Look at the positive side. Yeah, me. Look at me. You look at you. Positive side. So there's going to be some ups and downs. There's going to be way more ups than downs. I'm just going to say that. So if you're having any struggles, there's lots of positives about this. So maybe years down the road, you might have some issues, but think about the issues you will have if you don't do it. And these are all things that I, I, I had to consider and, you know, to help me make my decision. So I, I'm sorry about blabbering on guys, but uh, three month update, things are good. I can talk, eat, I can eat anything I want. The only, the only issue I have is if I chew on one side, the other side like move up and down like a teeter-totter. So I try to chew in the middle or whatever. Uh, if you get if you get or have dentures, you know what I mean. Um, I think that's it, guys. So that's that's today's update. Um, three months into it, I'm not sure uh, what the next video is going to be about. Maybe I want to try to start switching shit up a little bit because I don't want everything to be about dentures. You know, the channel's everyday life for a reason. You know, there's a lot more aspects and, and shit going on in my life than, than my dentures. I just like to keep you guys updated on it. So, with that, uh, uh, subscribe, like, share, comment. You guys, I want to hear some stories, you know. Comment. Let me know. Like, do you have questions, you know? If you're someone that's thinking about dentures and... Or someone who just got dentures and you, you're curious, comment, you know. I'll comment back. Let me know what's up. With that, peace, guys.